Today we're talking about leadership building activities. But first of all, I want to stop and I want to clarify what leadership is. So leadership is the action of leading a group or an organization towards achieving a common goal. Well, how do we do that? Well, I'm sure you've heard this quote, lead by example and others will follow. Well, that's easy, right? No, that can be very difficult for all of us at best. So how do we do that? So how do we get a group of people or an organization to move towards achieving a common goal? Well, it requires inspiring, motivating, and getting results. Well, how do we do that? It's based upon these principles. You have to build trust first to earn respect, establish credibility, and gain buy-in from that group of people or organization. So in order to do this, there are ways that we can build upon or improve our leadership skills and set up for success. So here are just a few activities. This is not all of the activities, just some ideas of where you can start. Well, first of all, you can take a team out of their element. So if you as the leader and your team are outside of your element, I've sh you may have seen like ropes courses or any outdoor type things where people are not really focused on their work. So just things come up sporadically, out of the blue, unexpected, and it's truly improv at its greatest. So you get the opportunity to see and experience your strengths. You may see some of your strengths arise, maybe some of them you didn't even realize you had, and then certainly, certainly glaringly, you'll see some things where you need to improve upon. So it's a great exercise. The second one is you can sign up for an apprenticeship, like volunteer to mentor under someone and let them show you uh, ways you know, on certain projects or certain initiatives and be there to guide you and show you and give you the ability to practice those leadership skills. Number three, create a specific plan with development opportunities. So there are all kinds of instruments you can use to perform an assessment. You've heard of, you know, DISC, you've heard of Myers-Briggs, and there are some other leadership instruments that you can use to assess, know where your strengths are and where your growing edges are. So what you want to do is you want to develop a plan with specific opportunities to make your strength stronger and improve your growing edges. So what would be some examples? So maybe you're very good at, maybe one of your strengths is uh, building teams or getting teams engaged. So you want to create a plan that will give you more of those opportunities. So that's a way to strengthen that muscle and continue to get even better. An example of improving your growing edges could be something like improving communication while under pressure. So a specific plan could be maybe identifying certain books you want to read or maybe a class that you want to take and give yourself specific opportunities to apply what you've learned. So if you need additional resources on leadership building activities, then sign up for our software now at projectmanager.com.